Hello everyone, I am the Flesh 3004 welcome back to Citadel Forged with Fire. Thank you for taking the time to hang out with me. I like seeing you. Thank you for being here. So as you can sit back, relax, enjoy the video, and let's get into some gaming. The last time we were here, we defeated a phoenix, and that was a lot of excitement. I didn't even know that they were there, and we went all the way up here here into this cave right here caves of plov no plav no so if you're looking for phoenix to defeat like i said last video you can go into here and find it and it's really exciting it's not a bad cave until you get to the very end and then it gets really hairy and it's really kind of exciting Ooh, hey ardara caves okay nice um so i started up the game and i was over here and i even Talking to my guys, you know, Blowtorch and Flamer and Birdie. And then I'm like, okay, well, where are you at, Giant? And I'm looking around, and I don't see him. And he's like, where is the Giant? I don't see the Giant. I don't know what happened. I really don't know. Is all I know is I came into the game. He isn't here. I go to C. I go to here. And poof. Gone. Gone. I don't know what happened. I have no idea. No clue. I did not see anything. It was like this. I noticed it was quiet, but I didn't see anything at all that happened. So I have no idea what happened. As all I know is it is the giant is no longer here. Uh, or uh, Goliath is no longer here. So... I guess either maybe he untamed and these guys took him out or something. I don't know. I looked around outside. He wasn't outside anywhere. And I just don't know what happened. He just is gone for whatever reason. Gone. All right. Well, I guess we also have some new weapons we have this one here and if i go here you can see that this is the superior griffin staff it's a little bit better than our other staff that we had by a tiny little bit well actually quite a little bit and then we have this superior hammer of uh, of hat red and this is better than our our sword here so i'm using this to gather stuff and the hammer of hatred is pretty interesting i've never had a hammer before as i said in my last video and this is what that looks like you can see me holding it right there it's pretty interesting it looks it is a war hammer that one looks like it has a bat right near the handle oh huh, that's cool i never really looked at them like that and there's a staff and there are the gloves those look pretty cool i do gotta say okay well i guess we are just gonna have to go out and do stuff we defeated the phoenix, as I said last time, so now we need to go and defeat a pirate. And that's something we're going to have to work on now. I do know where there are pirates. We just got to go get one and get one defeated and go get some more points. Since we don't have the giant anymore, that means that we can tame something else or do something else, I guess. Yeah, I looked at the tame timers for these other guys and 51 hours, 36 hours, and 27 hours. So they're all pretty good. They will be fine for quite a while. And I guess they're just going to have to be okay. This is the lowest one. And again, he's also the lowest animal. So, you know, there is that. Or tame i should say whether they be like giants or animals or whatever it's pretty much irrelevant except they're all teams now what i'm gonna do is probably head over because they're gonna be over here in this area in the reach and i know they're up here in the battle plains of talus i'm gonna go over to this guy right here uh throne of ignis and I'm going to come all the way over here to the Warden of Talus. And we're going to look around try to find ourselves a nice pirate to defeat. 
and then we'll go back to Sadie, since I know now know her name, because it had been so long between times that just really didn't have much of a chance to talk to her. We'll go talk to her. I need to get more food. We don't have a lot of food, but I can do that after a bit. And we're going to go defeat ourselves a pirate. Hopefully not get ourselves killed. That would be bad. But if we do, I guess we do. So I'll get over there and we will see if we can find that and get that defeated and continue our journey to our next level. So far I have not found a pirate. I have found everything else except a pirate. Wolves and, or yeah, wolves and uh, the floaty dudes and giants and skeletons and everything else, man. Except what I'm looking for. But over here, as you can see, I have a chest here. We are right here on Snake's Head Island on the very kind of, I guess, west tip. Uh, yeah. Whoa! But don't be like that, okay? Let's go get this guy open. Let's go see. Nice. Not a lot of stuff. Not a lot of high level stuff, but decent little stuff. Been attacked by birds, was attacked by a phoenix, of course. When you want a phoenix, there's none around. When you don't want one, there's one right, one right next to you. Just the way this game seems to go, you know how it is. And I'm pretty sure that this storm essence is what I thought. Just making sure. I want to get to a little bit safer place because I do want to show you a couple of things that my friend was telling me about and it is true because I did look and the heck oh I don't want to be in there 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 no spank you not yet we need to be ready. And we weren't ready. Alright, that was a nice little cave. Um, yeah, except we weren't ready. Just thought I saw a grid and it's like, what the heck is that? It was a cave. What the heck cave was that? Wild reached in. Oh, Bradley Cave. Bra Braid Isle Cave. Okay. That well, looked pretty interesting. I just don't know. We're down at the reach. How in the heck did I get all the way down here? Um, which way do I want to go? I probably want to go north. Yes, I do. Ended up in a completely different place than what I thought I was at. And that's okay. Whoa! Oh. So all I know is I heard something thundering towards me and about flip my lid. I think my lid did actually flip, to be perfectly honest with you. Dogon, scary things already jumped like three or four times. Things sneaking up behind me, making me jump. And those bears are quite as bad as the bears on Seven Days to Die, yes. A little easier with our powerful weapons, but as we get better weapons on Seven Days to Die, they will be easier too. Alright. I gotta go north. I still gotta find that the pirate. Now post, I like that. And we gotta get that done. And then we can go back and get our points, but first the pirate. So let me go find them still. And then we will be able to move on from there. And I did see a wolf right down there. How do you like that? Oh, not far enough. That's okay. He's a long ways away. 
Pirates should be around here somewhere, and I'm thinking they're little ways over that way. So let me just continue looking around. See if I can find one. That's the one that I saw. Take care of this guy and continue looking. Oh, shooty doodles. Well, I found a, uh, pi a pirate, but then I got attacked by a dragoon. Uh, scared the skedaddles out of me. Holy moly. Hmm. I almost turn near died, man. Oh. I got it. And the pirate was down there. I don't know where he went to. There's a couple of dragons hanging around here, too. Along with everything else, of course. So, that's all I gotta do is see if I can refine the pirate. Horse down there. There he is. He's your pirate. Oh, a golem. Nice. Just got to be careful of the golem, you know. Now we just got to fight this guy. Another one and a dragon all right it gets better all the time oh boy and so just so you know we're probably gonna die Yikers. Um, where's it at? Where's it at? There we go. Well, we might as well go and use one of those. We gotta get everything up. Death Weaver. Oh man. That is about the craziest, scariest thing I think I've seen in quite some time. Whoa, Nelly! Again. And of course, a nice dragon on my tail. And a dragon on my front. Yay, dragons everywhere. 
this be a dragon force or something like that, you think? I mean, yes, I wanted a pirate. I just didn't want everything else with the pirate. Woo! Man, this is crazy. And I have definitely found out something. Don't play these types of games when you're really tired. It doesn't help matters any when you can't concentrate and you're trying to concentrate. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, unless of course, you know, you like not being able to concentrate. And if that's the case, then yes, play them when you're really tired. And pretty much jump every time you get hit by something because it scares the snotty wobbers out of you. It's a real barrel of monkeys. Alright, I'm going to go find a pirate again. And we'll see if we can do something. There should be some down there. And there may even be a golem over here that we can get to. And that would be great. But the pirate is what we need more than anything, so I gotta fill up. Oh, there. Whoops. Whoopie doopy. wanted your opinion, I'd ask for it. Okay, so... Well, might as well just go and get this guy if we can, huh? All right, just got the golem. He is gone. Let's get out of here. Just ran out of mana. So, and I'm out of the charge for this as well. Oh boy, this is some fun, huh? There is still a pirate down there, so that's good. Not a pirate. Those are different. Those are on the ocean. As far as I know, this is not an ocean. Maybe it is. It's an ocean of land. How do you like that? All right. Um, let me get to a safe place again. Where are we? Okay, we're right kind of by the B in the Battle Plains of Talos. Okay. So I know where to come back to. There we go. There's one over there. I'm going to get over there, and I'm going to recharge this. 
And then I will show you what I was looking at. And there's a unicorn right there. How do you like that? Starting to get a little bit low on things again, but we will be okay. As soon as I get over there, we'll get this done and we'll come back and see about getting Unel Pyrant defeatolated. Okay, I'm in a safe spot. Now, what I wanted to show you was we're going to go to our things to repair this in a minute. But if we look at something real quick, well, you're going to notice that with the crowberries, if I can find them again, they do adds up to 1% damage to crafted spells. We generally use this all the time when we are going to here and we craft the spell underneath here. So we'll add that. We'll go ahead and do Ice Bolt. We'll get the slot. So we get 1% get there. But if you look at stuff like this, 3% spell energy, okay, that's fine. If you look at this, this does plus 2% damage to craft the spells, the buscus leaves, and if you look at those corpse flowers, they do 2% bleeding damage to crafted spells. I don't know what the difference is, but I'm thinking let's do more damage. That would be good. So, we can do that. That would be really good. Now, we have that ready, so let's go ahead and craft that. Now, that's going to help out a little bit. It isn't probably going to be as much as I would hope but it should be good to help. Let's go see, how is everything else? That's good, that's good, that's good, and that's good. Okay, I'm gonna let my mana and health recharge. I'm actually probably just going and take a health potion. And let's get back over there to the B, so we want to go about right in there. Right over there is where we want to be. Oh, right by the B, get it? Alright, talk to you when we get over there. I can see the pirate, and I also know that there's a dragon waiting over there too. That's one of the biggest problems right now. Yep, gotta go. I hit them. Now they're both angry. Ooh I forget how just how hard this game can be. So what I'm going to have to do is definitely get their attention. Oh, direct hit. Come on, buddy. There you go, just you and me. Dangerous. Okay. Hoping I can get his attention a little bit. As 
So if I can, that would be good. Oh, I got his attention, all right. Maybe a little too well. Let's do one of those. That should help. Let's do another one right over there. And let's just see if we can take this bad boy out, huh? I forgot I need all kinds of mana for that purple one. Alright, that should help. He's definitely coming down. Just as a very fast. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is going to be some fun. That's all I got to say. Oh, man. This guy's definitely a toughie. to get up here see if we can do anything from up here oh boy I don't know where he is at right down there huh That is fine with me. So I don't think he's going to be able to get up to me. I've said that one before. Good. Seems like we're going to be relatively safe here. Do this until he is gone. He is almost gone. One more hit should do it. Boom! Got him! Oh, boy. Look at the size of that foot. Holy moly. Ooh, fiery essence. That all he has? Okay. That's great. Oh, okay, there he is. Whoa, we're falling down. All right. Let's get to a safish place where we can recharge. See here, here. Let's go ahead and do these again. Two damage. 
there, there, and a there. All right, now we gotta get back to Sadie, get our points, and this took a lot longer than I was thinking that it would and hoping that it would. Let me get everything recharged and then we'll go over there and get our points. All right, we're now back over at Sadie's place again. Hey there, Sadie, how you doing? We had some death weavers on our tail. We had to kind of shake them, so, you know, how to do like this. How you been? We got the pirate. What do you have for us? Mm-hmm. I had a feeling in my actual return, a level of optimism I am unaccut unaccustomed to. Perhaps you are not as useless as the other mortals I deal with. Either way, I have more of the message for you. I awoke from my meditative trance totally drained, several days after entering it with the weariness of having been awake the entire time. The psychological warfare is far more wearing than the threat of physical harm, and there are even fewer places to flee. Perhaps it is pointless to try. Sounds a little defeating, doesn't it? Well, sometimes it is. Alright, one pirate defeated. Reward 62,500. We're not going to get total up to the next level but we'll be quite a ways more up man we got so much to go that's crazy we're at 297 655 so we guess we have 297,000 left or something like that mm -hmm. all right let's go see what you have for us perhaps it is pointless to try i think i could tolerate this scribe should we ever meet the last Part mentioned massive dragons, the form of one developed by the priests of Neshuan, who now developed by the priests of Neshuan, who now rain fire from above in this loathsome crypt. Oh boy! Test your abilities in combat against one in this land. The glyphs are nearly at an end. We may be heading home soon, which is providing a more unfamiliar but comforting sem sense of optimism. I, I can continue working on the final section while you are away. Infernal Dragon defeated 65,000 experience points. Infernal Dragon. Oh boy. Okay. Not today though. Not today. Thank you though, but you know, maybe soon, like next time. As far as right now, uh, I do know there are infernal dragons around, and one not too far away from us, I do believe. And I think they are the ginormous dragons. That's what I think. I could be wrong, but I guess we will see when we get that far. Whoops. So... I am going to head home and we'll get some stuff put away and go over what we're going to do next and see if perhaps up where that crypt is that we have been by, if there is a infernal dragon over there. Let me get to somewhat of a safeish place. I hope. Okay, that is undead. Oh boy. Don't know what that guy's doing. Looks like he's fighting a wolf. Okay. Uh, damn it. That place was this crypt up over here. Because we, came, we came, came over here, but we didn't exactly get too far because, you know, there's that huge ginormous dragon there along with the littler one but if we can take one of them out one of them may be the infernal dragons and if they are then maybe we'll have a little bit of luck there I'm hearing something over here and I don't know what it is heard a growling sound so I guess we'll go See if it's instant death or not, huh? I am gonna head back to our house. Oh, dog got it. You are a royal pest. You scared the snotty wobbers out of me. Again. What is that? 
What is down there? Oh, there he is. There he is. Lost him again. All right. I will see you back at the base. Okay, just some bike back by the base and there was a one of those ginormous dragons over there there is some of that fire essence and lava right up over there and that giant dragon seems to always be over there so i'm thinking that may be one of the infernal dragons we'll have to wait and see for sure i'm definitely not going to do it right now that's for sure these guys are just way too dangerous for my taste we're gonna have to figure out a way to take them on one way or the other anyway but, as I said at the beginning of the video, I don't know where my giant is. Apparently, he is gone. I don't think he's dead, but I guess he could be dead. And, looking at the weights of things, I do believe that I might have... Yes, I do. I do have things on these guys, so let me just go ahead and take all these off. Uh, I'm not going to take all that. I can tell you that much right now. And on you, I have a lot more clothing and stuff. And on you, I have nothing. Okay, cool. So you're the only one, Flamer, that ain't carrying extra weight. That's cool. I just got to get all the stuff off these other guys. And that's going to be an undertaking for sure. Let me just go and put... A bit of the wood in there. It's only a 490, so that's not really too terribly bad. But we still got to probably make another chest or two. That's why I left these two spots open. Hopefully we can do that. And we have all of our stuff here. I need to make more potions and everything. I'll work on that a little bit later. But we got our pirate defeated. We are a good portion of the way. A little over halfway up. Level 56 will be 57 soon, not 57 years old, but level 57. And then we will be able to get more points. And I don't think we have any points at all. We have three points there. We can't get any more food open because everything is already open that is going to be open. So we're already down to there. And we have the Phoenix Fried Egg open. We could do some mana potions or health potions but again we are really kind of low on points and i do want to get other stuff and work on other things so we are definitely getting really close this is supposed to be really good um it's not supposed to be very fast but it's supposed to be really good for like moving around and stuff but we don't have the four points for it anyway this is Citadel Forge with Fire. We got our pirate. We defeated a whole mess of other stuff that you didn't get to see. But it was all dire wolves and skeletons, like I said before, and other stuff. But we didn't die this time. That's good. So I do believe we are doing A-OK. -okay. You guys have a good day. And if you like this video, drop a like on this video. Remember to subscribe if you're new to the channel and you like what you see here. And... Tell your friends about my channel and share this, share this on your favorite social media, if you would, please, to anybody who's interested in these kinds of games. And we will talk to you next time. Bye-bye.